boy Abundance Run, we're the all in, but you're watching the Abundance Run channel. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, today we're going to be talking about a very important thing, continue the series on the 13 principles of success consciousness. We're going to be talking about imagination today. We're going to be talking about imagination today, guys. That's going to be what we're going to be discussing briefly. Um, previously, you know, we talked about desire, faith, out of suggestion, specialized knowledge, and today it's so imagination. Imagination, um, according to the 13 principles of success consciousness. Um, imagination is give shape, form, and action to desire using synthetic imagination to combine specialized knowledge with ideas. Imagination gives shape, form, and action to desire using synthetic imagination to combine specialized knowledge with ideas. All right. So, guys, if you don't know, uh, let's go. Let's go. Let, let me backtrack real quick to desire. And this is not a mere wish or hope, but a burning desire or a consuming obsession. OK, so you got to combine, combine that desire with this here. Specialized knowledge. Identify and acquire knowledge of the specific product, service or niche you intend to serve. OK, so what we're looking at is desire, specialized, name, specialized knowledge putting these two things together you end up having imagination guys so let's make it practical let's make it easy this is why i do these videos because i want it to be easy simple for those of you who are reaching for those of you who are trying to get to the next level for you for those of you who are just trying to work where you work and understand and how to get to the next level where you at this is it right here guys this is the next step so go back and watch those previous videos if you so you can get more of an explanation but with imagination man guys imagination so imagination is used using your mental mind right your mental mind i've been working on imagination when i was a kid guys it was so easy to pretend and imagine it was so easy that pretend i was here i was doing this i was doing that and and it was just so much fun if you watched the young kids as they're going through their baby steps and they're playing around they're imagining everything they don't they're not on the ground they're on a planet and they're flying they're fighting action figures or they're, they're fighting aliens and and then the the, the floor is in the floor. It's a sea where they're swimming and they're sailing. Guys, see imagination. Their mind is focused on these other aspects of what it can be there, you know? And, they're act, and, you, and you act on it when you're a kid. You act on it. You know what I'm saying? I used to take one of my granny's, um, like, little things she would put on the on the couch or whatever and i'll put it around me and turn it into a superman cape you feel me that's what i would do guys don't laugh at me but i'm just telling you to me that was my cape batman had a cape superman had a cape that little thing that used to go on the couch was my cape okay guys and so that's how it works count dracula had a cape too you did that's how it works out guys so you know um imagination is so key if you i had a burning desire to learn how to pop wheelies i had a burning desire so that desire put me in specialized knowledge i started watching people who popped the wheelies i started listening to people who talked about how to pop wheelies then i started acquiring tools and different things needed to learn how to pop wheelies that's what i can pop wheelies guys i can pop wheelies i can pop wheelies guys so you feel me this is what imagination does so I know we thought it was gonna be some intense, some mystery type of situation. No, guys, it's taking what you love, taking your burning desire, and then you researching, figuring out what the real things of that situation is, and then you take your desire and that information, and you begin to put, paint a picture for yourself on what it is that you want to do, and what you, what it is that you're trying to manifest, what it is that you're uh, wanting to create, which. I think that's very, 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 very powerful, guys. Um, I have more videos that are coming, and I'm going to try to get them out a lot quicker um, because we have more things to talk about. As we know, Napoleon Hill has studied uh, thousands of people 
um, learned and observed, watched and learned and observed what they were doing to be successful. And successful people sometimes can't tell you everything they do to be successful. But when you have a third party watching you, taking notes, guess what? Certain characteristics came out and popped out. He started recording previous videos, guys. We went up with the Puzzle Hill 17 Principles of Success. But now, guys, we're going to be going over we're into 13 Principles of Success Consciousness. That means 13 Principles of a Successful Mind State, a Successful Mental uh, Perspective in Your Head. you right. So we have now made it down to Imagination. The next one is going to be cool, too. I'm um, not going to review it. You really yet unless you jump ahead. If y'all jump ahead, that's fine. But um, I'm not going to jump ahead. Guys, please do me the favor. Hitting the like button. Please hit that like button. Go ahead and hit the sub subscribe. Please, I know you guys are new. Go ahead and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Select all because that's the way we ball here. Here on the Abundance Run Town, we're running up with positivity and just good energy. Get in the description box, please, as well. Review those links. Review those things that I'm sharing. The, the description box will be updated soon. Um, but please go there now. Um, I affiliate with those companies. I might get a little kickback. If you feel me. But um, um, with that being said, guys, please also get in the comment section. Really let me know how you feel out, what you think about this information. Have you used this information before in your life? Of course, I'm sure you have, but when you intentionally use it as a recipe, when you use it like that, have you? what results have you gotten? I would love to hear it, um, guys. So, yeah, get in the comments. Let me know. Man, I really appreciate you guys so much for staying, and I hope you guys are following this series. Please run the like buttons up. That lets me know you want more of this content. I look forward to giving you more information on this mindset, this success consciousness mind state because this is what we're going to need here in 2024 and going forward we really want to lock into these things and and, and work these things out to the fullest extent all right guys i appreciate you so much stay tuned